For the war in Ukraine to end the world must face up to some uncomfortable questions, Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky told a group of dignitaries on Thursday. Speaking at the fourth summit of First Ladies and Gentlemen in Kiev, Zelensky reminded the audience of how Western military technology can end up in Russian munitions. It is very easy to condemn a Russian rocket that flies into our school, he told the crowd. But it is not so easy to admit that this rocket can have parts from America, Europe, Asia, from any part of the world. Founded in 2021 by Ukrainian First Lady Alina Zelenska, the First Ladies and Gentlemen Summit is an annual event held in Kiev to help resolve global humanitarian issues. Напевно, важко знайти два більш частину найголовнішого, частину саме забрали частину життя. Так трапляється, якщо зло не байдуже, але тільки робить вигляд, допоки хтось свій роками вчиняє анексії, розв'язує війни і веде їх стільки, скільки потрібно йому. І буде робити це надалі, надалі, допоки світ довкола спить, допоки хтось світі робить вигляд, що йому. Не байдуже, але тільки робить вигляд, допоки хтось у світі вірить у наративи, що Путін протидіє нацизму в Україні. Війна торкається сьогодні кожного, і це, це початок нового шкільного року. Але він через повномасштабну війну, яка триває, лютого наші діти вже навчились. І це питання потребує чесних відповідей, потребує того, аби всі були чесними перед усім самі з собою. Бо дуже легко засуджувати російську ракету, бо це є факт, вона летить у нашу школу. Але не так легко визнати, що у цій ракеті можуть бути деталі з Америки, з Європи, з Азії, з будь-якої частини світу. На жаль, доводить це в усіх сенсах цього слова. Нити. Невже складно це вирішити? Володимир Зеленський. Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky met with leaders of the Baltic states in Kyiv on Thursday. According to the president's press service, the parties discussed the strengthening of military and technical cooperation during the meeting with Latvian Prime Minister Evika Silina. We face hybrid attacks almost every day from Belarus, now drones are flying over our country, so we are here to learn from you as well," Silina told Zelensky during the meeting. Lithuania's president Gitanis Nauseda told Zelensky that the West needs to push away red lines and allow Ukraine to use Western-supplied weapons against military targets on Russian soil. The sooner we understand that we have to push away those red lines that we draw too many times in our heads, the sooner the victory of Ukraine will come," Nauseda said. Military assistance was also on the agenda during the meeting with the president of Estonia, Alar Karas. We appreciate Estonia's decision to allocate 0.25% of GDP to Ukraine's defense needs every year," Zelensky wrote on his social media page following the meeting with Karas. But I'm happy that uh, all your team uh, is doing and uh, how you are representing your country. It is as well encouragement for us uh, to learn from you because we are a borderline with Russia and Belarus and it is not always easy for us as well. We have uh, hybrid attacks uh, almost every day from <coughs> Belarus. Now drones are flying over our country so we are here as well to learn from you. Western world, uh, 
to understand that we have to do anything in our hands to continue to support the Ukraine effort because Ukraine is doing incredible things on the battlefield and uh, there sooner we will understand that we have to push away those red lines we draw so many times in our head. There sooner will come the victory of Ukraine. You're very welcome, Mr. President. Thank you so much. And, uh, now I understand the most important, at least also for us, is to, to lift these restrictions put on, on uh, weapons what you get from, from West. Best. So we have been supporting or have been on this position on the very beginning, including myself. But uh, it's justified that uh, you are allowed to use these weapons to to target and uh, target military um, infrastructure on, on Russian ground. So, uh, and I hope that uh, our allies, especially US and UK, will allow to do so in many different ways. And, uh, of course.